The great blue herons in Stanley Park have just been here for likely hundreds of years uh, alongside the First Nations people that uh, used and lived in this land. But in this particular site, the herons have been here since 2001. So they started moving in and started with about six nests that year, so very few. And now we're up to over 100 nests up in these trees. The herons that we have here are particularly of the Pacific great blue heron subspecies. We have great blue herons throughout North America, but these ones here are special because they don't uh, migrate out of our area. But uh, between February to around early September, these herons will be coming uh, together to communally breed in, in these colonies and these trees and often they'll come back to areas that already have the nests up in the trees. It's probably less effort but it's also because uh, they know, uh, the population knows that these spaces have good habitat and they're, they have some measure of safety. So they come back every year because it's, you know, they assess the site first and see if it still looks like good habitat and um, and they'll move back in to breed, to raise their, to uh, lay their eggs, to raise their young and the young fledge um, and it happens again next year. <laughs> a lot of the residents will start telling us, oh man, the herons are breeding again. It's usually when the chicks have already hatched and uh, are about two weeks old that they make a lot of noise. Some may compare it to the noise of uh, children <laughs> making demands of their parents of, of their needs and wants. and so. Uh, yeah, that's usually the noisiest time of year. Often, because they've nested here near the tennis courts here in Stanley Park, they, the noises often uh, compete with the sound of tennis rackets uh, hitting balls, and it's really interesting. Um, and of course, they're also close to the beach and, and just a very public area, and so there's a lot of noise going on um, in their habitat, but the herons themselves make a lot of noise too.